Welcome to the Boardwalk on the Allure of the Seas at the end of January in 2024. Hey everyone, I'm Patrick from Oakland Travel. One of the four night cruises that goes out of uh, Port Canaveral, Florida. This was right before Utopia the Seas took over. Uh, actually, it was a few months before Utopia took over because this was January 2024. Utopia debuted July 19th, I think, 2024. So uh, this was a concept that Royal Caribbean came up with for the Oasis class ships back in two, uh, 2023 because they wanted to try to appeal to new cruisers, and but they wanted shorter cruises besides just a full on seven night, you know. And it worked out pretty well because the demand for uh, Allure when it was doing these and now uh, uh, Utopia from what I've seen is still very high. So Port Canaveral, Florida over into the Bahamas, three nights, four nights, they're just running a nonstop you know, rotation of those ships. Uh, now that Utopia has taken it over, Allure will probably go into a dry dock about the time this video is, is uh, debuted on YouTube. And then after the dry dock, I'm not sure what they're going to do with Allure of the Seas. Probably either Texas back to Galveston, uh, Miami, or potentially up to uh, New York, have it go out of Bayonne, New Jersey. So I'm not really sure what they're going to do with Allure. But here we are heading back to uh, the Aqua Theater because we're going to do the Ocean Aria show. And you see the sign right there for Sabor, uh, which is kind of the specialty restaurant just to the right of what the camera's looking at. We had dinner there one night during the cruise and it was very good. It was about $30, $35 a person, but uh, excellent Mexican restaurant there on the boardwalk, Allure of the Seas. And uh, this was January 29th, 2024. Oh, light it up. I thought you said lined it up. So, what do we got, an hour and, about an hour and 15, I think, before the next show. This is not too bad. It does feel like it's a little warmer than it was earlier today. It's the same temperature, it's like 55 degrees. It's just the wind is... You don't have the sun. Yeah, you don't have the sun. It feels like we don't have, the wind is a problem either though. Because, man, earlier when we were out here at 2.30, we were getting some pretty serious crosswind, and it was cold out here. The boardwalk at night. Oh, yeah. Look at Dazzles. Some, somebody's, yeah, it's open. We must have just missed it when we walked by there with the doors closed. So it's two stories, so that bottom level there is... Yeah, you see floor. yeah, see the drummer on the yeah. left and the guitar player in the center? Do you want to go there for a little bit? Yeah, we can. Not climbing wall. Obviously, they have it closed at night. Getting ready for the next show. I think it's Ocean Aria. So anybody that's got one of the uh, boardwalk balconies can basically watch the Aqua show without having to make a reservation or come even come down here. laying out the towels. Oh, I see, I think that's the splash So, So if you want to get wet, you sit down there in those uh, lower seats. So I did my uh, live stream earlier. I was sitting right there, freezing. That's the windjammer. Huh? That's the windjammer. Yeah. yeah. Is that that back area? Yeah, that's the back area of the windjammer up there, Damn. and then above it is the, are the suites. Man, so you see you the, got nice views if you sit in those tables. Yeah. Mental note. <laughs> yeah. Look at, all the, look at those sweet balconies above it. Yeah. yeah, those things are expensive. Okay, that breeze is a little cool. Yeah. 